Hi Floss Two, welcome to my channel. I'm Pam. Today is Thursday, December 3rd. Thursday, December 3rd. Happy birthday to my niece. It's her birthday today. Um, and this is Flossmas number three. Um, I'm doing quick, short, daily um, vlog style videos for the first 24 days of December and the, we are calling them Flossmas videos. Um, what? Oh, sorry. I'm fresh out of the shower, so my hair is feeling a little bit crazy and I'm not quite settled in yet. I feel like I've got an excuse for my, my brain fog every day. My brain has been mush. Um, okay, so on my Flossman's videos every day, we are doing a giveaway for a Prairie Schooler mini card. Um, and all you have to do to enter is comment below and have my Google form that's in the description box um, filled out. That's it. There's... It's, it's as easy peasy as that. Um, yesterday's winner was uh, Jean Truckee. Yay, Jean, that's so exciting. So Jean has already filled out my Google form, so that's gonna go out in the mail today. Um, I love, it gives me an excuse to mail a card, which I love. I spent all yesterday doing my Christmas cards. Um, I do love, I do love filling out Christmas cards. There's something just, I like the repetition of putting, addresses on envelopes and sticking stamps on, I don't know. Anyway, um, I'm having a good time with this giveaway. Um, some things to remember, you must be 18 to enter and fill out my Google form and um, don't say giveaway in your comment and all you have to do is comment. But if you want to comment and you don't want to enter the giveaway, just don't fill out the Google form. It's as easy as that. Um, because if I pull a winner and then the, they haven't filled out the Google form, I'm just gonna pull a different winner. Um, I hope that I explained that. I explained it better in video number one. So if you wanna go back and watch that one, um, maybe that wouldn't be a bad idea if this is your first Flossmas of mine. Okay, so we also talk about, what did I do yesterday? Um, I said that I was going to start um, four boys and an NL girl, uh, collaborated again with Caroline from Off the Grid Needle Arts to make a flossness ornament. Um, words are not coming. Flossness ornament to benefit, uh, Muscular Dystrophy Canada. So half the proceeds from this chart go to, go to that charity. Um, and it's Canadian $5, but in the States the exchange rate, when I bought mine, it was $4 and three cents. I don't know what it is today, but it's super cute. And I started it yesterday. Um, I'm changing out the house color cause my house is green and I want to be home for the holidays in my house. Um, so I got a fair amount done. This is being stitched on a piece of scrap fabric I had. It's 32 count. I don't know what it is. It's not Swigart though. Um, so yeah, I, I mean, this is going to be a quick stitch because I got like all the brown here done in, you know, an hour and a half or so yesterday. So yeah. So I plan on working on this again tonight and I'm stitching that in avocado, gentle arts, avocado. I don't know where my, oh, here's my floss. So this is the house color. And then I think I swapped out all the other colors too. Um, well, we'll talk about that as we go, as it gets stitched. Um, and then I worked on a little more of my tree trunk for, do you see what's happening there? That's magic. He's, we have three cats, that's our oldest. He's 14 and magic. Mm -hmm. Hey, what are you doing? Do you wanna say hi to the people? Yeah, are you eating the Christmas tree? So do you see my little carolers? They, I love our carolers. And every night I have to take them off of this and put them on my kitchen table uh, flat because Magic gets up here at night and tries to eat the Christmas tree and knocks them down and one has already broken. So yeah, Magic, hey, can you maybe not Eat the, tr eat the tree? He says he's not sure. He thinks he needs to eat the tree. Okay, where was I? <sighs> it's always something. Okay, 
I am stitching for 2021, Stitch a Mommy's Temperature Tree. I started on the trunk because come January 1st, I want to stitch a leaf and I don't want to stitch any trunk. So yesterday it was looking like a mustache. Today it is looking less so like a mustache, but I suppose it could be like a really, I, I don't know. If you had a long face or like a lot of space between your nose and your mouth, it could still be a mustache. I mean, maybe a little bit. Um, I am using Weak Style Works. Nope, Gentle Arts. Gentle Arts Wood Trail is the brown I'm using for the tree trunk. Um, so my plan today for this is to just get one length of floss in, and then I'm gonna go back to the ornaments. Um, and I figure if I put one length in, for the next few days, I'll probably get that branch done pretty quickly. And then I won't have to worry about it. I mean, maybe I'll keep going and doing one length of tree trunk a day um, because it's manageable if I have time. And that way I won't be scrambling at the end of January to have get the February branch done. Oh my God. <sighs> Cats. Now, if my dogs were upstairs, they're downstairs in our finished basement right now. If my dogs were upstairs, the kitchen is the dog space and the cat, we have, we have to have gates because my dogs, one of my dogs, my basset hound does not like the cats. So the cats have safety space in the living room and our bedrooms um, and there's gates and we live a gated life. So if the dogs were up here, you wouldn't be seeing him, but they're not. This is their sleepy morning nap time. So, okay. I think that's all I had to say today. Oh, I did want to show um, one of my favorite, my favorite things that I put out for Christmas every year. My parents sent, a, sent me a card a few years back. And when you pulled it out, it came flat like this, but then it opens into like a little snow globe, like it's three D three dimensional. And they're little owls and they're so cute. And I couldn't, I even though it was a Christmas card, I put it out every year now as a Christmas decoration because I love it so much. And so I wanted to share that with you. And um, that's it for me, I think. Um, I, ha I did wanna say that I have a, floss, a new Flossmas song percolating around in my head right now. And I think that it will, it's, it's taking a little more um, time to put together in, in my head than my first one did. So, but I think it's gonna be ready maybe for Monday. So if you've been hoping that I would come up with another Flossmas song, there might be one happening. Um, okay, so that's it. I will see you guys tomorrow. Um, yeah, have a great day, everyone. Bye.